Welcome back, it's crafting time. It's crafting time. Okay. Welcome back, crafting spirit boosters. How you guys doing? Well, you know what today is. It is practicing decorating two trays, and today I am struggling trying to decorate this two-tier wooden tray. I have things up here, but I'm not comfortable with what I have up here because I need more of something else. Specifically, I would love to have some kind of flowers or leaves, stems, berries, something else besides just setting these things up here like this. So this is what I mean for this collab, practicing doing this. For some people, they've been doing it a little longer and they can just do it effort effortlessly. But I still have to practice using these types of things on a tear tray. Now I can put some food up here, <laughs> but doing this, I have to be patient with myself and let my vision hopefully come through with more practice. But I got the North Pole Bakery sign. I have a couple of logs up here. I have a couple of reefs on here on the bottom tier. Let me spin around. I got the stack of uh, books, Christmas cookies, rip it, recipes with the gingerbread on it. It's so much more can be added on this tier tr bottom tier tray, especially sitting on top of these stack of books and something in between there. So yes, I need more practice. There goes the little snowman all decorated up, ready for f the holidays. <laughs> the little reef. That's the bottom tier. Now let's move up to the top tier. I just used my little apple, five cent apple sign. And I have the milk jug can that says Merry Christmas and a snowman is sitting inside of there. Very festively decorated snowman sitting inside that Merry Christmas jug milk can then i have some more reefs and i really dig this sign right here <coughs> excuse me family gathers here i really really like this sign and i decided to keep it in here even though it's not red or anything but i like it and so i kept it because it's making me happy and i like it really really like it so that's why i'm sharing it on my two-tier wooden tray. Now I'm going to uh, do this with the camera sitting up. I got it on widescreen, but I'm going to narrow it. So, yeah, it's another episode of practicing and decorating tier trays, and this is what I have to offer today. And I'm struggling putting this tray together today. Hopefully next time I'll be a little bit better. But I need more something on here. I see gaps. And I see where things can be added. Where it could be cheerier, more festive. I need some berries. I need some leaves. I need some more... Mm, I love the family gathers here sign. I'm really, really digging that sign. I really, really love that. I do. But anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Practicing Decorating Tear Drays. <laughs> Miss Janita's struggling today. But I have to show up to show out. <laughs> and oh, also, don't you guys forget to go and visit the other participant. Go visit Pat's channel.
she's amazing at doing these tear trays and her space where she decorates is also awesome so go and participate go and support her channel join it if you haven't and uh give her lots of likes help her channel grow okay and that'll be it for today oh i just want to mention i have started a junk junkie junkie junk veil challenge invite for all of you who are interested you want to make a veil from scratch mine is like about four or five six inches veil you if you're not crafty at um uh sewing or anything like that doing crafting well this is a crafting channel so i assume you have some skills but if you don't you can always get a plain bell excuse me and junk and decorate and junk it up come back every saturday and show an update of what you added to your bell you don't have to do it all in one day that's what i think i'm you know what i'm gonna let this challenge go until january 1st it'll end january 1st it started saturday let me see what's the date today is the 28th or the 29th whatever saturday is 28th or 29th 10 28 23 it started saturday so every saturday you just come back and do an update of what you added to your bell don't completely uh junk it up unless you want to do it that way but uh preferably you know come back saturday and share what you added to it i think that's the fun of the whole challenge just showing and it's not the best but it's the it's the uh, most junkiest one okay guys so love to have you guys join the challenge and share your bells and we'll see how each other decorated <laughs> that should be exciting you can talk about if you struggled to do it or you had a great time you enjoyed it yeah invite your friends if they like bell making or want to join a challenge and like to uh show what they can do <laughs> invite them to join the challenge okay so that's it guys i'm not gonna keep you any longer thank you for watching and don't forget i got my gardener channel collab over there on saturdays and i also got my grocery channel collab over there on wednesdays talk about your groceries food events shortages tampering all kind of stuff talk about your neighbor's groceries so forth and so forth all right y'all have a good one happy crafting thank you so much bye see you next time for crafting time for crafting time